Well, the industry seems to have been in turmoil, really. Um, some of the milk, it depends which milk company you're with as far as selling your milk's concerned and what contract you've got. Well, the supermarket initiatives are, are, are a step forward. We've, we've had these dedicated supply chains, like the Tesco one, which is the one everybody sort of relates to. And that, that actually is very good because for those farmers producing milk for, for liquid milk for Tesco's, uh, they're getting a price of around 29.93 or 63 pence a litre at the moment, which I think a lot of people will be very, very pleased to get. Uh, if you, it, you know, it, it pays the cost of production plus, or included in that, is a depreciation figure and a figure for your own labour. So they're getting a return on the on their investment as well as uh, as well as a return on the cost of production. Well, I'd, well, there are several at the moment that are just reducing the price of milk, and some of it is to do with currency. I know that. I know that the ARLA price is reduced a little bit on on on, uh, on currency exchange rates, and that I understand is going to happen again in January. These are, you know, this is our world market conditions that we're working with, and a lot of lot of our milk, bulk of our milk is sold at home, and is unaffected by that. But somehow, all the milk seems to be affected by the small amount that we export. Well, the only way I think that we're ever going to get sorted out to where we want to be is, is through contracts, and, it, and those contracts are important. And in our own case, we, we're working with an A and B portion to our, our milk production, and the A part is basically the amount of milk that our buyer can process and sell into the marketplace at, at what is a contracted price for his products. And then we have a, a, a cost of production price uh, for our milk from him for the A part. The A part really is based on what we produced last year and the profile that we've put forward for this year. Then if we produce extra milk, and we, we, are, we have been because we've had a good grass year as I said, um, then the B part is paid for at a price which is related to the money that he can get back from the marketplace. So it, it, it's a fairer system and it also means that he isn't committed to buying milk that he hasn't got a home for.